This is a presentation of offshore information processing. Offshoring generally refers to the outsourcing of services by workers in another country. Many organizations outsource jobs to specialized service companies, which typically operate abroad, that is offshore. Because offshoring involves sourcing skills from other countries, it raises different outsourcing options across a wider range of organizations and operations. The offshoring trend stands to continue. The latest wave of offshoring impacts the information technology field, which results in offshore information processing. Offshore information processing includes data center operations, help desk support, and customer service, software development, e-commerce sourcing, network operations, and disaster recovery. As a an example, if you call one of the telcos in Australia and speak with their service representative, you have a high chance to talk with someone in a call center located in a foreign country such as the Philippines or India. If you are the owner of a chain restaurant, your expertise isn't necessarily in computer. By outsourcing your IT needs, you can focus on what you do best and let another professional organizations focus on what they do best. As a business, small or large, you need to focus on your core competencies. Offshore information processing allows management to defer the details of IT to a specialized company. Secondly, cost saving is an important driver for offshore information processing. Organizations view offshore information processing as a cost-effective means to expand their IT capabilities. Thirdly, offshore information processing offers flexibility for business to adapt to changing demands. Offshore information processing also offers geographic and time zone benefits that are otherwise difficult to have. Outsourcing to foreign countries involves hidden costs such as travel expenses. Although offshore information processing may be driven by low cost, organization cannot be complacent and needs to be careful with hidden costs. The second downside is the organization loses complete control over the outsourced business functions. Offshore Outsourcing sites often experience high employee turnover, which may lead to service quality being compromised. Thirdly, information and data security will continue to be a major concern for offshore information processing. For instance, when the organization terminates the agreement with offshore entity, confidential, sensitive information might be jeopardized. No doubt, offshore information processing is gaining momentum. Cell Matters Beyond Borders report suggests that 64% of a business choose to use lower cost staff from overseas. Despite the high expectation of offshore information processing, in reality, there are gaps between expected and actual benefits such as the cost reduction area. To wrap up, businesses cannot afford to turn the back on offshoring as a new source of opportunity. Getting the most value from offshoring begins with an understanding of your competitive advantage and then looking at work functions that could perform better and more cost effectively. When choosing the offshore partners, instead of focusing on cost cutting only, also consider the service quality and how you measure it. The success of offshore information processing relies on how organizations manage the risks such as information data security while taking advantage of offshore information processing.